stop. When the signal says stop, wait. When the signal says wait, and go only. When the signal says go. fully embrace the scientific method as American evangelicals. And we think as time goes along, as we discover more and more facts, that we'll learn more and more about how God created the heavens and the earth. The scientific method clearly demonstrates that the world is four and a half billion years old. We do accept that. Yeah, you know what you're doing is you are you are accepting some of the views that are accepted in some portions of the scientific community as fact. Where in where in fact your grandchildren might listen to the tape of you saying that and laugh at you. You want to bet? Sometimes it's hard for a human being to study the ear or study the eye and think that happened by accident. I beg your pardon, did you say by accident? Yeah. What do you mean by accident? That the eye just formed itself somehow. And who says it did? Well, some evolutionists say it. Not a single one that I've ever met. Really? Really. Oh. You obviously know nothing about the subject of evolution. Or maybe you haven't met the people I have. <laughs> but you see, you, you do understand. Thank <laughs> you.
morning, I went to the beach. And as I was standing there, I noticed my feet got cold and wet. And as I looked around, I figured the beach was gone. station of our own so that we could be independent at least that's what my father always says
die negative Kunst ist kein rein digitales und neuzeitliches Phänomen. Auf eine gewisse Art kann Jackson Pollock in der klassischen Moderne mit seinem Action Painting als einer ihrer Vorreiter betrachtet werden. Die späteren Künstler des Process Art, Klammer auf unter anderem Bruce Naumann, Robert Morris, Eva Hesse, Klammer zu, bilden eine direkte Brücke hin zur prozessualen, von Konzepten dominierten Kunst des späten 20. Jahrhunderts. Gemeint ist all diesem der Wunsch nach Darstellung des Entstehungsprozesses als integralem Bestandteil des Kunstwerkes. Unnatural. 
minds and the hearts of our children. Her version or profit. The Military Chaplains Association of the United States, practically every major fraternal, civic, and religious organization, the juvenile court judges, the Federal Bureau of Investigation, innumerable psychiatrists, sociologists, and psychologists, attribute the moral decay among our people in very large part to the obscene and pornographic literature so prevalent in our society. These abnormalities are corrupting the minds and the hearts of our children. Perversion or profit. These abnormalities are corrupting the minds and the hearts of our children. Perversion or profit. These abnormalities are corrupting the minds and the hearts of our children. Perversion or profit. This moral decay weakens our resistance to the onslaught of the communist masters of deceit. you have to go back to what young brother here referred to as the house negro and the field negro back during slavery there was two kinds of slaves there was the house negro and the field negro the house negro they lived in the house with master they dressed pretty good they ate good because they ate his food what he left they lived in the attic or the basement but still they lived Negro would look at you and say, man, you crazy. 
nigger. And that's what we call him today because we still got some house niggers running around here. Oh, God. 